So this girl apparently still wears diapers at age 17, so let's find out why. Hey, my name is Maria. Hello, Maria. And in this video, you'll find out how I told the guy I was dating that I still <sighs> wear diapers even though I'm 17. I didn't even think like how awkward that would be if you found like a partner and you had to tell them. Oh. Years old. I guess you're wondering why I'm wearing diapers? Well, when I was a kid, I was in a serious car accident that left me with nerve damage in my lower spine. I had to have a lot of physical therapy to help Oh my god, it's so horrible. Recover. That's what's crazy. This literally could be any of us. It's like if people make fun of this, this could be you. You just can't. And I also lost control of my bladder. Ever since, I've had to wear diapers. I sometimes feel ashamed about my condition, even though I know it's not my fault. And I never told anyone at school about it because I knew I'd be bullied. That's also why I hate PE class. I don't want any of my classmates to see my diet. Oh, because it'd be really thick. I guess they would. I wonder if it's like total loss of control. So they're like pooing as well. Papers when I change clothes. Luckily, I got a special permission to use a private changing room. That's, I'm so grateful for that. Even though I get teased for thinking I'm more important than everyone else, but I don't mind. Okay, wait, can we just go back one second? Does that trigger anybody else that they forgot to color in this little star right here? Ah, oh, else, but I don't mind. I'm also always wearing long, flowy dresses at school, but no one knows That's pretty, why. though. That I tell really them nice. it's because I like to look classy, but really, it's because if I was wearing jeans, everyone would see my diapers. <laughs> My Aww. biggest worry was about dating, though. Would any guy ever love me oh, despite no. my condition? Oh, okay, yeah, I feel like an absolute dick for laughing, but that was a pretty funny animation there. Would I ever be brave enough to tell a guy about my secret? I was- Dating's already so scary. I could only imagine how she feels. I wasn't sure, but then something tragic happened. A year ago, one of my classmates was diagnosed with a brain tumor and passed away. Oh, my goodness. Away. Her death put everything into perspective, and I realized how lucky I was and how short life could be. I mean, These stories I, always have such beautiful meanings behind them, I can't. Could have died instead of her. After that, I decided not to be afraid of dating anymore, and I joined an online dating site. The first few guys I met were really weird, and I began That's to online regret dating joining you. <laughs> the site. But then I got lucky and I met a really nice guy. Can't relate. His name is Mason and we'd been dating Aww. for around six months when I decided I had to tell him about my condition. I told him we needed to talk and he got thinks that she's gonna dump him. <laughs> really nervous because he thought I wanted to break up with him. There it when is. I told him about my condition and showed him my diapers, he was shocked. But he oh was- Oh no, will he stay? This is the moment of truth. Will he stay? Still really sweet about it. He asked why I wore diapers, so I told him about the car accident and my nerve damage. I was so nervous because I didn't know if he'd want to stay with a girl in diapers. I mean, if he wanted to break up, I'd Could completely be an asshole, understand it, even though I'd be devastated. But then he said something which made me cry. He said he loved me for who I am, and my condition wasn't a problem for him because as long as I was happy, oh, he'd so be happy humble. too. Wow, I can't describe how grateful I am to have Mason in my life. He accepts me the way I am this is and so for the first time humbling. in my life, I feel like I'm good enough. I mean, of course, I still wish I didn't have to wear diapers. I mean, they make adult diapers for a reason. It's not like it's in her control, so this is actually really sweet. But in the end, so what? I can still have a great life surrounded by beautiful people like Mason. Just remember that only you yep. can decide how you react to the challenges you face. Do you wear diapers and feel sorry for yourself? Or do you wear diapers and make the most of your life? It's all up to you. It's Thanks so for listening sweet. to my story. It's so like, ah. Uh, it just makes you feel like shitty about anything, like small inconvenience you've been upset about before. Uh, <laughs> that is the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Bye.